why Nvidia did this deal with the Grok. So Nvidia is buying the AI chip startup Grok, G-R-O-Q, with $20 billion of assets for its largest acquisition ever. So what made Nvidia having this big deal? Because in just in September, Grok was only valued $6.9 billion and it's like almost three times of the original valuation. Nvidia is paying to the Gronk what made Nvidia making this decision. So we all know Nvidia, amazing company, the number one company in the field of GPU for training of the AI model. For last few years, every big company was pushing hard on training their AI models at scale. Thousands and thousands of GPU bought from Nvidia and Nvidia was printing money. But what has changed? What made Nvidia to look for Grok? Now, first let's talk about the Grok. Grok is a nine-year-old company which is having really, really powerful LPUs, a specialized chip which is used to inference the AI model, the bigger AI models. And here is the main difference. While NVIDIA is more focused on providing something which is used for the training of the bigger models, Grok provide for the inference of the model. That means basically whenever you prompt something and the algorithm it runs on a chip is provided by Grok. So how many times you train a model? Very few. But how many times you infer a model? Almost thousand times or million times every day. So which one chip is more useful and more, more needed? Obviously the one which is inferring. So you see, you only train model once but you endlessly infer the model for the lifetime. And where is the money seems to be like? Obviously, initial money is on the GPU, but later on, once the model is already trained, the money is on the inference. And there is the deal with the Grok, with the Q. See, we all know Jensen, the CEO of NVIDIA, took it from a normal chip company to a giant AI company. And this is made Jensen a smartest person in the field of AI. He clearly know when to shift the gear for the next big thing. When AI training was in the case, he pushed more on the GPU, the more powerful GPU that can be used to train the AI model. But the GPUs he created, like, like Nvidia created, was the general purpose GPU more of used for the AI model training. Here is the catch. Jensen clearly sees the trend. It's now falling towards the requirement for the GPU for the training of model. Many big companies is now having their amazing GPUs, the thousands and thousands of GPUs, and some of the amazing companies started building their own chip, especially the Google TPU, the tensor processing unit, which is why the Gemini 3 is so great not only just on inference, but also on the training. And here is the magical thing. You know who created the concept of TPU in Google? The name is Jonathan Ross. But do you know the CEO of Grok? Jonathan Ross, yes. In 2017, Jonathan Ross left Google and started the Grok. And here he created the LPU, a specialized unit just for the inference of the AI model. That means the concept of TPU, the power of a chip that can be so powerful and is specialized for the model in training as well as for the inference is now available on the Grok. So obviously Nvidia, Jensen cannot buy the TPU, cannot get to the Google and say that they give me the technology. But what he can do, he can grab the, the company who is founded by the person who actually created the TPU is now happened. And if we talk about the deal, it's not actually acquisition. So Grok will not getting into the 
part of the NVIDIA and Croc will be destroyed. Croc will used to work as it was, but this deal is called a licensing agreement to accelerate AI inference at global scale. So basically what's going to happen is with this agreement that reflect focus on expanding the access to high performance and low cost inference in the NVIDIA. And that's really a good thing because it's not total acquisition. Croc will work as it's as an independent company and this deal or this agreement is so great that next you will see NVIDIA coming up with so amazing chips that will more focused on inference rather on the training level. So what do you think about this kind of deal? Let me know in the comments section and follow me for more AI updates.